Your friends won't stop parking in my driveway. Congrats your parents know you vape at 16 foot. My neighbors have a teenage son whose friends keep parking in my driveway. I went to check my mail last week and saw them all out front and decided to nicely bring it up which was met with eye rolls and fake okays. Monday comes around and I come home to find three of his friends' cars taking all the space I have to park. It was a 14-hour day for me so I wasn't having it and made my second approach with intention to make myself very clear, and said I'd make it the neighbor's son's problem. Tonight I get home and it's happened again. I went next door and an adult finally answered. I brought up the cars at my place and added a side note their kid never expected his also been throwing his disposable vapes in my yard, and I have the other neighbor as a witness so I casually asked them to make sure that stops and the instant change in expression, told me everything I needed to know after I walked away. Shortly after his friends left and I can assume they probably won't be back for a while. Happy Spring Break Kid Act like an irresponsible kid instead of a teenager approaching adulthood and you will be treated like an irresponsible kid. Will played on your part. Great job. You probably put things in perspective for his parents. He needs to learn how to respect others. Maybe he does usually, but to be disrespectful and have his friends he just as disrespectful would probably lead to arrests. Plus his littering and thought you wouldn't find out or turn him in. Hopefully he learns a valuable lesson about respect. If they're parking in your driveway on private property I'd call a tow truck. That awkward moment when your vapes get you grounded. Up in smoke, kid. I can't imagine parking in some random person's driveway as an adult, let alone as a teenager. I don't even like parking on the curb near people's houses. Love it but make sure you have cameras covering as much of your vehicle, house and yard as possible. Even if it is just ring cameras at every door for now. After the first warning I would have been tempted to just get a tow truck involved. Why do kids think they are going to get over on adults? Love your revenge in all of its pettiness. It's really easy to stop people parking in your driveway or blocking it. 1. Politely inform them they are not allowed to do so and any future trespass will be resolved at their expense. 2. Next time it happens, call any local tow company and have them towed. The tow company won't charge you, they'll charge the registered owner. It would suck if you were so clumsy you dropped nails in the driveway every time they parked there. So clumsy. If it happens again, have all the cars towed. The kids will have to explain to the parents why they have to be picked up. You probably did them a favor. Every kid who smoked or vaped had to go through their parents finding out eventually and you just did it for them. Teens just can't realize when they're being given a chance by an adult to correct themselves instead of getting in trouble with mom and dad. A lesson learned through experiences like this lol. This is why you only break one rule at a time. Either vape or piss off your neighbor, but don't do both. Good example of fucking around and finding out. Next time it happens call a different tow company for each vehicle and have them removed. When they ask where their cars went just say you had them towed away and they can figure out where they ended up. I'd say you showed a great deal more restraint than I would have after multiple warnings. Good for you. Good I hope they made him go over and clean up your yard. Actions have consequences. This is a good step, but if it happens again, time to have the car towed. I guess you can always park them in, and then take an Uber out for the evening and not come back until late. Then go to bed when you get home. Then, oops, I'm going drinking with colleagues after work, I'd better Uber to work just to be safe. Kids stuck in driveway until you're good and ready to move your car. IDK about other states, but in FL it's legal to have a car towed if it's on your property without the car's owner's knowledge or consent, you know, for next time. I'd start having them towed. You've told them not to park there. It's your private property. It'll teach them a valuable lesson. I would have blocked all of their cars in the driveway until I had to leave to work next. 
or order a giant pile of stone mulch and have it placed directly behind so their cars are stuck for a few days. Or let all the air out of their tires, taken parts from their car. I mean if they leave it in your property it's fair game. I used to be a police dispatcher and cars blocking driveways could be towed if the homeowner called us. I'm not sure if it's applicable everywhere but if they still don't stop it's worth a try. Having the cars towed would have sent a much louder message. This is so strange. I cannot imagine parking in someone's driveway. This makes me so mad. Regardless of being a teenager there are some things you just don't do. I have lived in stratas for the past three years and for them to be taking your parking spot is literally infuriating I would have out a sugar pack in the gas tanks or let the air out of three tires or something so props for being mature and going to the parents. Tow the fucks next time. It's your driveway, private property. Have fun for now but that kid seems spoiled beyond help and he will try to exact revenge whenever possible. What I want you to realize is there is no limit on how low such people might go. Wonderfully petty a thing of beauty face with tears of joy. Get them towed. Well played. Hope that kid learns from this fafo experience. Have them towed, won't happen again. Park behind them and block them in, take a long nap and do not answer the door. Let the air out of a few tires. So many ways in the naked city to stop them, pick one. If the car is in my driveway, I'd just tow it. There's no excuse for parking on someone else's driveway. When you choose the behavior, you choose the consequences. Well played. I would have called a tow truck then told the parents. I would have just warned them once then had them towed the second time. Savage I love it. There are companies that tow cars. Use them. Was this in your driveway like on your property? The story isn't clear about this detail. Sounds really ballsy of them to pull onto your property, not to mention you could have just had them all towed which likely would have sent a stronger message. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. Anytime someone parks illegally on your property, call a tow company. They are like vultures and will be out there in a heartbeat to take care of it. Lifelong lesson folks, only break one law at a time. Or in this case be a dick in one way at a time. Much harder to be given benefit of the doubt, a warning, etc. when you've done two completely independently wrong things at the same time. Tow trucks would have been called. Next time, just let the air out of their tires. Why not just have the car towed? They gonna break your windows chief. Those parents should know don't fuck with your neighbors and don't let your kids either. General indifference is best if it's not outright friendship. You never want animosity. He 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 well played OP. Well played. Sounds like you need to get some hollowed out caltrips. I only know about disposable pot vapes, are there nicotine ones? The pot would explain the parents being so pissed. Ah yes, mess with the ball. Why didn't you call the police or parking authority to deal with them? What is wrong with people? Why would you tell them about how cool their kid is as revenge? Snitch lol. I can't wait to read the other side's a petty revenge story. Snitch. You sound like a bitter old twat. They 100 aren't parking in your actual driveway Karen. Yeah you're the asshole. Three of his friends cars taking all the space I have to park. How many spaces do you need to park? Vaping at 16 ISNT even that bad I began smoking in like middle school lol could be worse. You are trash. 16? That's rookie numbers, my neighbor's kids have been throwing vape cartridge boxes in their driveway since 14. Oh, I left a handful of nails behind your tires. Why didn't you have the vehicles towed? 
In multiple places I've lived if you're towed for trespassing you have to pay cash. 